Hey everyone! In today's video, I'll be showing you a step-by-step -step guide on how to deactivate Windows by removing the product key. Before we start, let's quickly discuss why you might want to deactivate Windows. Deactivating Windows removes the license from your computer, making it possible to use that license on a different device. Or, maybe you're selling your computer and want to ensure the new owner doesn't have access to your license. Quick Disclaimer this tutorial is for educational purposes. Removing your product key can impact Windows features, so be sure this is what you want to do and have any necessary backups before we begin. Before we deactivate Windows, it's important to take a few quick preparatory steps. The first step we'll do is check our activation status to confirm that Windows is currently activated. Go to your settings and navigate to Update and Security. Then select Activation from the side menu. Here, you'll see your current activation status and details about your Windows license. The second step we'll do is, if you plan to reuse this product key, it's a good idea to write it down. You can find the key by using Command Prompt or third-party software. Keep in mind, once you deactivate Windows, some features will become unavailable until you reactivate with a valid license. All right, now let's get into the main part. First, we'll use the command prompt to remove the product key. Make sure you run it as an administrator to have full access. Type CMD in the Start menu search bar. Right-click on Command Prompt and select Run as Administrator. This step is crucial because we need admin rights to make system changes. Now, we're ready to remove the product key from Windows. In the command prompt, type the following command. S L M G R space forward slash U P K. This command stands for Software Licensing Management Tool, and U P K is for Uninstall Product Key. Press Enter. This command tells Windows to uninstall the product key from your system. After running the command, you should see a message confirming that the product key was successfully uninstalled. If you don't see this message, Try restarting your PC and running the command again. Now that we've removed the key, we need to clear any traces of it from the Windows registry to fully deactivate Windows. In the command prompt, type this command. S L M G R space forward slash C P K Y. This command stands for Software Licensing Manager and C P K Y, short for Clear Product Key. Press Enter. This command clears the product key from the registry. This is done to prevent malicious code from stealing the key. If successful, you'll see a message that the product key was cleared from the registry. Finally, let's verify that Windows has been deactivated. Go back to Settings. Select Update and Security and click on Activation. You should now see a message indicating that Windows is no longer activated. This means we've successfully deactivated it by removing the product key. If you encounter issues during the deactivation process, here are a few troubleshooting tips. Make sure Command Prompt is running as an administrator. Without admin rights, the commands won't work. These commands generally work on Windows 10 and 11. If you're using an older version, the commands may vary. And that's it. You've now learned how to deactivate Windows by removing the product key. This can be a handy trick when you want to free up your license for another device. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more tech tips, and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out on any future content. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.